think I gained slightly more stuff over the course of this trip, but I also lost some stuff, so I have about the same amount of things. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yo, it's around 4, 10 p.m., so I'm boarding in 20 minutes. Closing words on Taiwan. The good, bad, the ugly. No, I'm just kidding. So here's the part where I think about what I want to remember when I watch this 15 years from now. Ending order. So most favorite to least favorite things about Taiwan. Wait, no, that's right. All of my favorite things about Taiwan, but in descending order of how much I like them. First, the dance community. Dance community, you guys have probably heard me rave about it already, is really crazy. Everybody's super friendly. I will never forget my time practicing here, and I will miss it very, very much. So I haven't mentioned... I haven't really mentioned this before, but basically once I came to Taiwan, I never wanted to go back to mainland China. Uh, the people in Taiwan are much friendlier than those in mainland China, which have a reputation for being kind of mean. People are willing to help me read menus, willing to work with my not-so-great Chinese, and definitely other people have expressed similar sentiments. Okay, third thing. The food. A meal costs anywhere from 2 to 4 USD. In my opinion, okay, I actually have super low standards for food, but like a really good meal, 3 USD easy. Meat and rice. Taiwan's pretty famous for its food, the night markets and shit. And also the portions are not giant, like the shit you would get in America, because America's trying to make you fat. Fourth thing, nature. I like nature, although actually I realized during this trip that I don't really like forests. Yeah, I hate the trees. And Taiwan has a lot of beautiful mountains, forests, oceans. You name it. In fact, I'm sitting in this little terminal that celebrates the beauty of Taiwanese nature. Okay, but what about the bad? The first thing I would say is the Taiwanese education system. In short, I think it steals away the childhood of the students. And this is pretty common in a lot of Asian countries, but from talking to college students, from talking to students that are in high school, these students are spending maybe 12 hours a day on average in school. They go to normal school, then they go to what's called cram school outside of school. And a lot of the time for these kids, I've heard that when they reach college, they just burn out. They stop working so hard. And for some people, it's like they work so hard, but school for 12 hours a day, it just doesn't turn out that well for them. And then so there's this sense of hopelessness, like, wow, I work so hard. I went to cram school all the time, but for what? So I'm partially at fault here for working at an SAT school, basically perpetuating this system. But definitely the Taiwanese education system is one thing that I think needs more work. Second thing, this is not actually that bad of a thing, but an interesting cultural note is that if you're my age, like a uh, young adult male, then lots of young adult males will just like stare at you when you walk past them where they'll just stare for super long. Like, it doesn't happen with females, it doesn't happen with old ladies, it doesn't happen with adult males, but with other young males. I don't know if they're trying to, like, rep themselves or something. Again, it might be a cultural thing. I found that slightly bothersome. It's not, like, something that was stressful. I would definitely say that these 40 days have generally been the happiest days of my life. I had a job that wasn't bad. In many ways, it was good, but it wasn't bad. Like, there are some of the shittiest English teaching jobs you could imagine in other countries. And I'm really grateful for the way that my job turned out. I had a good practice spot. I felt like I was at home. I had a dance community. I think my metric for measuring how happy I am is whether I could die at any day and still have been happy with how I live my life. And that's definitely the case with Taiwan. Maybe I'm an emotionless person, but I never really feel a sense of sadness when I'm leaving something, even when I enjoyed it very much. It's just the next stage of life, so I'm off to Korea. I'm unsure if I'm going to keep doing these video logs while I'm in Korea. Oh yeah, thank you to the, I guess, 50-something people who consistently watch the video logs. Like, I appreciate the kind words that people have said. You know, I don't really know who watches. Not my own older brother, because my older brother sucks. I think he watches sometimes when his girlfriend forces him to. I'm really happy that I ended up successfully recording almost every day. Obviously I'm not doing this to get super famous, otherwise I would be doing a different format other than my five to seven minute video. But whatever, like every person who watched, I'm really grateful that you spent the time to watch maybe even one or two minutes of the videos. I really hope that maybe you guys have learned along with me what it's like to live in a different country. This is my first time. Thank you Taiwan, much love. Modest and share make the wings of a great b-boy. Hello, it's my last day in Taiwan. Oh, I forgot to mention that I stayed with Larry last night. 
this was the bed that we shared. Larry went out to a bar, came home really drunk, and I was like, honey, why are you always coming home drunk? And then we got into a huge argument. No, I'm just kidding, I was asleep by the time he got home. I just packed my big backpack of stuff. Yeah, off to lunch, and my flight is at 4.50 p.m. to Korea. Last meal. Last meal. I'm at a loss for words. Yeah, chicken rice. Fruity beer that Maya has tricked me into buying. It's actually really good. You don't like it? Nah, it's okay. The people of Taipei. Returning the metro car. The Taipei bus station and there's a Taipei West bus station. Very confusing. I'm heading toward that thing. It's 2 p.m. Take it. I think I ran out of data just as I got to the airport, so I used to have 8 gigs in my 40 days. I was tethering a lot to my computer. My calculations were perfect. 